Today we're standing on the uh, Loyal Sock Creek in Lycoming County, Pennsylvania. Just historically, there's been a lot of significant flooding here um, that caused integrity issues for the pipeline. The Lighty A and Lighty B were both exposed in the secondary channel. So we worked with uh, engineering consultant, state agencies, federal agencies to come up with a plan to not only stabilize the watershed, but also to maintain the integrity of the pipelines. So basically the, the project is a two pipeline replacements for Lighty A line and Lighty B line. And a portion of the project is also restoring the portage for the main channel, which we call this section of the Loyal Sock Creek. Here in the main channel, we installed uh, three boulder riffles. We work with the uh, Pennsylvania Fish and Boat Commission and design them to allow boaters and recreational fishermen to have better access to the stream and to be able to navigate down through easily. My role with the contractors is to, to make sure that they're, they're following the William specs and the job guidelines and the scope of work. When we first started, it was probably approximately 125 people here. It was quite the project when we, we first started. I grew up probably about 20 minutes north of here in the Lowellstock watershed. So when I was approached by my manager to have the opportunity to work on a stream restoration project that I grew up you know, fishing, hunting in the area, spending time here with my grandpa, and also my daughter. It meant a lot to me to be able to do something well for the community. So I'm looking forward to when the project's done that she can you know, enjoy kayaking here and fishing like I did when I was a kid. So this spring we came back when weather conditions allowed. We planted a mix of 5,000 trees and approximately 10,000 uh, plugs. I feel like the project really came together and I think it's really well off than it was before construction. Even though we completed construction early this spring and came back and did the plantings, you know, Williams is committed to continue to monitor to make sure the project's successful and to make sure that the integrity of our pipeline is intact as well as the stream itself. So to have the opportunity to work on a project like this and to, you know, from an environmental standpoint, uh, maintain a stream that I love was meant a lot to me.